And if you are for the high welcome back, honeybees. <coughs> so this video is going to be a hair review featuring Ellie Mo Hair. I want to say thank you to Ellie Mo Hair for sending me this unit, the one I'm wearing right now. Um, I really enjoy working with them as a company. Like y'all need to get some hair from them. I'm about to show y'all how many things came in this box. I was just so amazed in the quality of the construction of the wig. Like, I just was so amazed. So, I wanna give a big shout out to Ellie Moore Hair for really coming through with the girls. So, in the box, I showed you guys, I'm gonna show you probably on the side right here too. In the box came all these awesome things. You know, I got this, this. The girl that gave me a comb. Who does that? Who gives you right to comb? So I just was so impressed and so pleased when I actually <coughs> opened the package. I already was happy. So um, I've been wearing this hair for about, I don't know, two two weeks, probably two weeks. And this is how the frontal looks. Um, I had to pluck it, definitely, definitely, definitely pluck your frontal. I did bleach too, but you have to pluck it to make it look natural because the hairline, the way it came, it looked pre-plucked, but it wasn't plucked enough for a person to wear without looking like, what are you doing? So, yeah, um, the hair, okay, I'm going to tell you all the pros and the cons about this hair. The hair is so soft. First, it's so soft. Second, um, I washed it and conditioned it, and it stayed good. The only thing with the hair I do not like is it does not curl. Like, it curls, but it doesn't hold a curl. I'm actually going to show you guys on camera how I curled it and how long I kept it in that it should have worked but it doesn't hold a curl very well um it does not shed it does not tangle the only time this wig ever shed was when I had to pluck it you know and that's regular so um I don't really have many cons about this hair I'm actually very impressed with the unit as a whole because when you guys see I have these stretchy parts in it that's holding it together so I don't actually have to use the straps in the back um I could put it up, but I didn't cut off this um, this piece here. So if you plan on putting yours up, you're going to have to cut that off. I didn't do that, though. But yeah, look how... I'm about to cut it on camera so you guys can see. And I also will show you guys the process of me bleaching it and everything and how it looked before I plucked it. So this is the wand curl I've been using when I use this unit. Um, it's heating up, but... I usually take it and push right here, push right here, and hold it down at the top. Also, if you want to, you can get some mousse. I'm going to do that myself. I'm going to get some mousse and a red tail comb and comb the sides. So I'm going to show you guys my camera. And I'm going to use the red tail comb that Ellie Moore Hair sent me, you know, just because I got it. They hooked your girl up. So, yeah, what I do is I just three there three there oh oh it fell it fell y'all so let me help it get that out of the okay so you want to just comb it back with the mousse this is if you don't have a hot comb if you have a hot comb this step is not necessary at all but if you don't have a hot comb I have a hot comb I just don't know where it's at So yeah and also if your hair is not flat you can take some more mousse and a soft bristle brush and brush this out down but mine is laid right now so I don't really have to do that okay so now I'm gonna show you guys how I curl it okay y'all so I changed my shirt real quick but yeah first you want to brush Make sure you get out any initial tangles. Also brush going backward. Okay. 
Then I take a little, little piece like this and I curl. I count to 60 each curl and then I catch it, hold it, and what I tried doing one time, I even tried pinning them. And they still fell like almost immediately. You know what? I'm gonna try something different on camera. Cause that one tends to be staying, and I think I know why. I'm gonna grab the next piece. And you see, I don't take super big pieces. Like, I'm gonna get some mousse in my hand. Maybe that's gonna hold it. Brush that through. Okay, I think I'm on to something. I think I'm on to something right now. And I'm gonna go ahead and curl. So I'm gonna curl this whole head probably off camera. This song gotta waste our time, but we're gonna see if the curls hold this time or not. And while I'm curling, I'm gonna show you guys the footage of me bleaching and you know first installing the wig. So yeah, okay, get on the net footage. So like I said, this company sent a lot of great things with their wig. And I'm just showing you guys all the things that came with this wig. I was so amazed and shocked because I have never received packaging like this from a company. Okay, y'all, so I'm guessing this hair, if you mousse it before you curl it, it might stay longer because this is the longest the curls have ever stayed up, but I always brush them out. So let's see what happens as we brush them out. And it is not like running through smoothly like it usually would if I don't use the mousse but the curls do look more defined 
than they ever usually did. So maybe the key to having defined curls with Ellie Moore hair is using mousse. Um, it does feel less silky, but it's starting to, it's starting to get back smooth. I don't know, y'all. Tell me how y'all feeling about it. Tell me what y'all think. Do y'all like the curl? Did y'all like it better the other way it was? And what I always usually do is I put that behind my ear. I'm gonna insert some clips of how I've been wearing it. But I usually um put that behind my ear. Just like that. And I'll add two bobby pins. One going this way, one going that way. So you create an X. And I always, um, to add more volume, I didn't do it today, but to add more volume, I always put my hair, I put my head upside down and I shake my hair to add more volume, but it has more than enough volume today, I guess. I guess the mousse really helps, um, but yeah, y'all, um, this is how it looks. Do y'all like this? Y'all like this? I'm, I'm, I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. If y'all want a video showing... With me showing y'all more ways to style this hair, y'all let me know because this video is already going to be long enough. Y'all let me know if y'all want a video like that because I could do it. But yeah, y'all let me know if y'all want a, another video of me styling this hair, you know, in different ways. Because it is a frontal. You can do like two buns right here. You can do half ponytail, half down. I'm, I'm going to do a quick little style for y'all. So that's pretty much how I've been wearing it, you guys. Pretty much just like this, you know, combing it up just to create that nice volume look we all are going for these days. And yeah, if you guys want to see an updated video on how I style Ellie Moe hair or different ways to style Ellie Moe hair, let me know. Cause I can definitely do that. You, you guys just let me know what type of videos you want next. What type of videos you want for my channel. And I will do that for you guys. So yeah that's the end of the video. And I hope you enjoyed this video. Another shout out to Ellie Mohair. Thank you for sending me this wig. I love 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 this wig. And yeah. Um, see y'all next one. Bye. Okay y'all. So I'm not wrapping this video up already. But. As you can see, the curls are still falling. They're still falling. Even after I did all that, they're still falling. So that's the only thing about any more hair that my feeling is I will spend my time curling the hair and it just it just fall back. Let me show y'all the back. When I say this hair don't hold a curl, this is what I mean. I literally just curled this hair. I'm gonna add this into the video. I literally just curled this hair. Y'all saw me curl the hair. <coughs> and this how I look. But yeah, y'all. So if you if you're if you don't care about the curls falling, then Ellie Moore hair is perfect. Everything else is perfect. I just don't really like the fact that I curl the hair. It doesn't look bad, but it's gonna get back frizzy and it's gonna fall. And it hasn't even been an hour yet. So yeah, um, that's all. Perfect.